Hey guys, don't worry, I'm here to help you to fix this problem with the step by step perfect solution. So let's begin. Now we need to click on advanced options, then click on troubleshoot. Now click on advanced options, and at the last, we need to click on command prompt. Type chkdsk slash f slash r c colon and hit enter to execute the command now wait for some time to complete the process once done move to the next step now type c colon and hit enter now we need to type cd space c colon slash and hit enter to execute now execute this command type cd space windows and simply hit enter now type cd system32 and hit enter now type cd space config and simply press enter to execute this command now type md backup and simply hit enter now type copy space star dot star space backup and hit enter now type md backup one and hit enter now type copy space star dot star space backup one and hit enter now type cd space reg back and simply hit enter then type dir and simply hit enter now execute this command type in copy space star dot star space dot dot and then hit enter after that type all and again hit enter to execute the command type in boot rec space slash fix mbr and hit enter to execute the command type boot rec space slash fix boot and hit enter now type in cd space c colon slash and simply hit enter to execute the command now type this command cd space windows slash system32 slash config slash regback and simply hit enter to execute the command now type this command bcd edit space slash exports space c colon slash bcd backup then hit enter type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type this md space boot and hit enter type cd space boot and hit enter now type md space bcd and hit enter now type cd space c colon slash and simply hit enter now type attrib space c colon dash boot dash bcd space dash h space dash r space dash s and hit enter to execute type in ren c colon backslash boot backslash bcd bcd dot old and simply hit enter to execute this command type bootrec space slash rebuild bcd and hit enter type exit and hit enter now click on continue it will restart your system so that's it guys your problem is solved and you are good to go